Hello, welcome back. I'm out here in the sunshine. <laughs> it feels absolutely amazing. It's about 60 degrees outside. The sun is shining and there is a cool breeze. It's awesome. I am going to take advantage of, I should say we are going to take advantage of this beautiful day and hopefully get another good chunk of this year's garlic planted. So in today's video I'm going to talk to you about garlic. <laughs> um, yes, it's late in the season to be planting garlic. I'm fully aware of that. <laughs> Normally this is done in the fall um, so that the plants have a chance to sort of overwinter and um, just don't have any excuses it just didn't get it done so I did some research found that um, soft neck garlic is a quick growing garlic so there's two types of garlic there's a soft neck and there's a hard neck hard neck is what I usually plant they send up the scapes and they flower soft neck does not do that that just means I won't have any scapes this year which is fine it's not the end of the world I'd rather have a garlic harvest. Um, soft neck also stores really well. I'm really hopeful for because um, storage, long-term storage is really important. There's nothing more defeating than um, feeling like you put all that time and effort into growing and curing your garlic and then they don't store. I had that happen to me a couple years ago. They got like they dehydrated almost, they became really hard. And I could use them, and I did use them. Um, they're working great for the animals, but just wasn't ideal. So, um, Amanda's gonna be joining me and we are going to be hopefully making another pretty big dent in our garlic planting this season. We planted some a couple weeks ago and they are already sprouting. I guess you could say it's working out pretty good because we have had a pretty weird winter, like 65 degrees right now in January in North Georgia. And I think this time last year it was snowing. So um, being that our fall and our winter has been a little on the warm side, I think it's gonna work out in our favor. We had that Arctic blast, polar vortex, whatever you wanna call it. It came in around Christmas and I'm really glad I didn't plant my garlic then because I don't know that it would have survived. It got so cold. They told me my, people told me my carrots would be fine and they weren't. Um, so I'm really glad that maybe my procrastination paid off and uh, it didn't get planted sooner. So I'm hopeful we'll have a good harvest. It might just be a little later in the season than we're used to. But that's okay, it's all gonna work out.
Now the goal is to have this whole thing covered. As you can see, I'm clearing out um, my summer crops of peppers and tomatoes and some herbs as I go. But so far we've got all of this planted and we're just working on it little by little as time and weather permit. We purchased the garlic in bulk from Azure Standard. The way I was able to tell whether it was soft neck or hard neck was whether or not there was a stem in the middle of it. Since there was no stem, which would have been where the um, garlic scape would have came out of, then I knew it was soft neck. So I know we're still okay to plant it because it doesn't take as long to grow and mature. Maybe you've already done it or you've missed your window. I know places that are way up north you're covered in snow. You're probably not going to be able to do this but maybe it'll be something that will help you for next year's garden or something that maybe you haven't thought of planting that you can plan for. So anyway thanks for as always hanging out with me in the garden and may the Lord bless and keep you. Until next time.